What started as a peaceful rally for peace after the presidential election ended with MSU students locked inside the school's union last night. Campus police say the university had to close the building for safety reasons. It happened hours after about a thousand people gathered at MSU's Rock. Fox 47's Faith Miller was there. Donald Trump announced he had won the presidency, and within hours, the Michigan State College Democrats started organizing this rally. My representation is gone, and if we get together with all these students and all these people here and show that, listen, like, we have a voice, we're still here, no matter who's in government, they still have to listen to us, and that, you know, together we are stronger. More than a thousand people gathered at The Rock near the center of campus. Knowing that there's a lot of support locally is um, a really good feeling. But this is not a political rally, and organizer Connor Birdie says it's definitely not an anti-Trump protest. People are, are sick of politics, the election cycle and all this, and we don't want to make this a partisan thing because making it partisan excludes people. Birdie says the gathering is about bringing people together, especially after a divisive election. It sends a message that we are strong, we are still together, and that um, we have rights and we have things that our elected officials, no matter what party they are, have to listen to us and have to stand up and represent us. Which one man at the rally says is important because the political parties will probably only become more divided. Events like this are necessary. To voice the people's opinion more than, you know, the political leader's opinion, because I feel like a lot of times those two, two opinions are different. After the rally, hundreds of people marched down Grand River towards the Capitol, then looped back around and walked as a group through campus. In East Lansing, Faith Miller, Fox 47 News. MSU police say the rally remained peaceful throughout the night.